saxophones this is the tutorial for one octave scale number three so concert a flat your f scale so let's take a look at this on the full scale side your learning side we've got f here one two three four g one two three a one two then we get to b flat now b flat has a couple different fingerings uh the one that i like to teach at the beginning is uh right here here's our here's our b flat note and the first fingering it lists is one two and the bottom side key i can show you this here we got one and two down just like we're playing in a and then our the side of our finger is going to press this bottom side key over here on this side so one two and the side key is what i like to use when you're first starting out there's another one later we'll talk about later on okay so after we go to c we'll go to to b flat we'll go to c which is just second finger middle finger then we switch to D again. This is where your octave key comes in. So octave key one, two, three, four, five, six. Then we go to E, octave key one, two, three, four, five. Okay, that note is right here on our fingering chart. You can see right there. Then we've got the highest note on the scale is F, just like the bottom note, right? Remember the top note and the bottom note will always have the same name in our scale. So we've got F is right here, octave key one, two, three, four. Okay, so notice from the D on up, we're going to keep that octave key down. Remember that sec that fourth line D from there on up on the saxophone, the octave key is depressed. So we're going to play the scale going forwards and going backwards one time on the full scale side. One, two. version the pass off version and we look at that here we're going to tongue on the way up we're going to slur on the way down so leave your tongue out now on this one we, the the b flat that we used on the other side is now over to the side in what we call the key signature right so this note right here the fourth note of the scale is going to be b flat not b that's probably the most critical note on this scale the one you're likely to miss so if you want to take your pencil and put a flat sign right between that A and B. So before you get to the A, you see it to the left of the note, then that you go ahead and do that. Over on this side on the way down, the flat again goes to the left. So this time it's between the C and the B, making that into a B flat. And then of course we've got our arpeggio where we're gonna tongue. So let's get our instrument ready. Make sure you take a good breath, finger the F right now. One, two, Time you play, freeze at the end. 